In this video, we are going to use Smart Notebook to create a geometric figure. I've drawn a line here. I'm going to go to its properties and change the line to thin. I'm going to create parallel lines, so I'm going to copy and paste this line. And I will paste another one to turn into the transversal. And now I will use the Shapes tool to get a triangle. So I can draw those little parallel marks on here. I'll go to the Properties, give it a solid red fill, change the line to a thin line, and rotate this triangle to fit on the line. I can resize it, use my keyboard arrows to position it. Once I'm happy with the parallel arrow, I can copy and paste, and this one will be in the proper orientation for the other line. And now I'm going to group all of these together. And now I have a figure that I can copy and paste into Microsoft Word. Once I paste it in here, I'm going to right click and change its text wrap to none. By doing that, I can freely move this through the Word document. I am now going to insert a text box. Inside of the text box, I hold down the Control key and the plus equal key to open up Microsoft's Equation Editor. I can type my expression. drag the text box to its appropriate location and I will copy the text box and paste it to put into the other location. We can edit the expression and as I hold down my shift key I'm still holding down my shift key I click on each of the components I right-click on the border, and I group these together so that they move now as one. I can copy this now. I can paste it. Now I have two problems, and I can come right in and edit my text box. without having to create an entirely new problem. 